Nike is making big strides in the metaverse. A $10 million piece of art got burned in the name of NFTs. And Build-A-Bear joins Web3. You are watching Meta Money, and this is Web3 Under 3. Now, before we start the clock, make sure to smash that like button and don't forget to hit the subscribe and notification bell. That's the best way to help the channel grow and so we can deliver more value to you. Nike is one of the largest and most recognized brands in the world. They are also the highest earning brand in the NFT space. With over $185 million in sales, their market share is exponentially higher than anyone else. Now, if you look at this chart, you will see the rest of them combined still won't even come close to Nike. While the most people, $185 million is very impressive, it is dwarfed by the more than $12 billion Nike makes each quarter. Woof, that's a lot of shoes. Now you can get that special someone in your life, a teddy bear, and yourself an NFT. Famous for their custom stuffed animals, Build-A-Bear has entered the Web3 space by launching three digital collectible projects paired with physical items. There's even a one-of-a-kind Swarovski crystal crusted bear. NFT platform Mint has partnered up with the company to mint the collections and they'll be on Polygon. The platform allows customers to pay in crypto or fiat. The Web3 move comes on the feeling that jumping into the NFT space means tapping into a collector's market. Sharon Price John, president and CEO of build bear said in a statement, this announcement speaks to our future in a world that's increasingly about the physical blending with the digital. Every aspect of this multi-dimensional collection is designed to capture the appeal of our brand and the collectability of our furry friends. The Swarovski edition will be sold at auction between October 4th and 6th. The starting bid is $2,500 and 10% of the final sale will go to the namesake charity. There will be two other mints as the year comes to a close, so make sure to stay in the loop if this is something that interests you. The art world is up in a tizzy, Mexican authorities are looking to solve a crime, and millionaire Martin Mubarak is about to sell some fire NFTs. He said, people might see it as I destroyed it, but I didn't, Mubarak said. This way, I'm bringing it to the world, I'm letting everyone see it. I think it does more for good to the world and makes a statement rather than just sitting in someone's private collection. The ink and watercolor image named Fantasimos Sinisteros, or Sinister Ghost, which Kahlo drew in her diary, was burned at a swanky South Beach party and has been met with some skepticism. James Oles, a specialist in Latin American art, said he destroyed the evidence that would determine whether it was real or not. Isn't that convenient? Now, it is widely known that there are many fake Frida paintings, so this one may just go down in history as a cold case. Well, that's all I got for Web3 Under 3. Thank you for watching. Comment down below with your favorite Web3 or Metaverse projects that you want us to look at. Oh, and don't forget to click the notification bell on your way out to stay up to date with all that is Meta Money. See you next time.